hey guys welcome to my channel game of bitcoins and in this video i'm going to tell you how to transfer your mind coins from your offline paper wallet to cryptopia exchange so as you all know electronium has launched on cryptopia and currently you can trade electronium coins on cryptopia the current price of electronium coin is around 11 cents so if you've got some coins mined in your platform in your system you can transfer them to the exchange and then sell them or trade them now in this video i'm going to talk about the cli wallet of electronium which is a command line interface wallet of electronium there is no other wallet currently available through which you can access your offline paper wallet so this video is going to be a bit technical and i assume that you have some knowledge of operating dos commands or the command line interface but even if you're not comfortable you can follow the steps exactly what i do and you will be fine but i take no risk responsibility of anything going wrong you have to follow the steps exactly as even then because it's a command line interface things can go wrong so guys if you are unsure if you're not confident that you will be able to do it then i suggest you do not now let's start with the first step so the first step is you have to navigate to the github page of electronium to download the cli wallet now the links are all in the description below so you can just click on that link and go to this page and in this video i'm going to talk about how to create a wallet send your coins through windows machine so you will have to have a windows machine installed i'm going to download this windows x64 wallet and make sure that your system is 64 bit and not 32 bit because this is only for 64 bit systems i have already downloaded this file and what you need to do is after you download the file you just need to extract it to any folder now the second step go to your offline wallet the offline wallet you would have created and you would have this pdf if not then you can watch my earlier video on how to create this offline wallet so this i assume that this is the wallet which you had created and you are mining on this address so the public wallet address that you see here it should be the same as what you are mining in right so the next step you have to copy this entire address paste it in notepad and make sure you remove all the spaces in between because if you keep the spaces it will not work the next step copy the private view key again just copy the entire thing make sure you do not leave out any character because this is very important private view you can copy it separately under private view make sure you remove the spaces then we move on to the private spend key copy and we copy this under private spend so after you have done this step the next step would be to sync the electronium blockchain on your system and how do you do that you basically navigate to the folder where you downloaded the earlier windows cli wallet go into that folder and double click on electronium d file make sure you click on electronium d file a command prompt will open and the command prompt will look like this and once this starts running you would see that this starts this will start syncing with the electronium blockchain you would see all these blocks being synced this will take some amount of time around 10 to 15 minutes so let this sync with the blockchain and only after you get this message you are now synchronized with the network you may start electronium wallet cli only then move on to the next step to move on to the next step what you need to do is to go you have to go to the command line prompt so if you're in windows 10 just click on the start menu type cmd and open command prompt and once you are in the command prompt you will need to navigate to the folder which you basically downloaded the cli wallet in click on windows explorer click on the folder this will select the entire folder path just copy it and go to your command prompt and just navigate to this directory so what you need to do is just write cd space and just paste this to paste just click right click on the window so once you do this hit enter now this will navigate to this folder in this folder the next thing that you need to do is you need to write this command so all these commands are in the description below you can just copy paste them directly so copy this command paste it 
now this is your wallet file so i have kept the name as testing.etn but you feel free to keep whatever you want make sure this part of the command remains the same and you can only change the name of the wallet so once you do this click on enter now after this this will ask you the address so this address has to be your mining address which we have already copied in the notepad file so all we need to do is just click on this control c paste it here click on enter then we need to enter the secret spend key we have already done that so private spend and secret spend is the same control c and paste it then we need the secret view key control c control v and enter now it will ask you for a wallet password just keep a password for this wallet file so keep a password so this password can be anything you want now after this is done you would see that a new wallet has been created now this wallet needs to be synced with the blockchain so once you see this and this has been created just click on enter do not enter anything else this will say starting refresh and this is going to sync with the current block of the blockchain so this might take around three to four minutes so we'll just uh, wait and let this sync okay so now the sync is complete and your wallet is actually ready and the next thing you need to do is enter this command called seed s double -E d click on enter you need to enter the password this will ask you to select a language so whatever language you are comfortable in you can select for English it's one so just enter one and click on enter now what you see here is the seed you have to copy it and paste it in your notepad file just keep it safe now this seed is basically uh, very important you know to restore your wallet so if you lose this seed you will not be able to restore your wallet and your coins will be lost similarly with your private spend key private view key so everything is very important just make sure you keep them a safe place and do not lose them now after that what you need to do is your wallet is completely ready the next command that you can do is uh, to check your balance just write balance now obviously since this is a test wallet i do not have any balance but if you have any balance in your wallet now this should show so if you have any balance and you want to transfer that to cryptopia first of all you need the wallet deposit address for cryptopia for that you need to head over to cryptopia on the deposit section in cryptopia you have to select the currency which is e and etn which is electronium click on next and this will display a payment id and a cryptopia deposit address so copy these two so first of all you need to do is copy the deposit address head over to a notepad file the command is transfer and we paste this cryptopia address so the command is transfer space put the address put a space and the amount of coins you want to transfer so for example i transfer 277 coins space and then copy this payment id so this is the entire command that you need to run all you do is just copy this entire command and paste this in your command window after that just click on execute we need the password and since i do not have any balance so it will not transfer but i have done this step and let me just show you that where the transfer went through successfully so this is the window where i did the transfer and what you can see you can see the transfer command here and after this it says just submitted the transaction so after that it will ask you a question about the fee level just make sure you click on yes so i entered yes here and the next step is that the transaction would be successfully submitted and would become in progress and after 10 to 15 minutes you would see that your balance has been transferred to cryptopia if you would keep this window open this window will keep on automatically updating itself and whenever it 
shows you the text in the purple color that means your transfer has been completed and then you can just head back to cryptopia and check whether it has been done or not so if i just click on view deposit history this should show my reset transfer of 277 coins yeah so this is the 277 coins which i transferred from my offline paper wallet to the cryptopia wallet now after this you can just trade normally on cryptopia so guys all the links and the commands are in the description below as always if you have any questions please mention them in the comment section below or you can chat with me on my discord channel i hope you like this video if you did please give a thumbs up please do not forget to share this video with your friends as well because a lot of people would be stuck with their electronium coins on the paper wallet so it will help them as well make sure you subscribe to my channel i'll keep on bringing videos like this to you i'll see you guys in the next video till then have a safe investment